Okay, in this video, we're going to solve this problem right here, and we're going to use the elimination method. And so, let's begin. So if you see, this is 2x, this is 3x, this is 5y, this is negative 2y. We can't double, we can't triple anything to easily eliminate one term. And so what we need to do is actually manipulate both equations. So we get to choose. Do I want to eliminate x? Do I want to eliminate y? They're pretty much the same amount of work. I'm going to choose to eliminate x. That's a 2x. Let's make it into 6x. So I got to multiply it by 3. Now if I, if I get 6x, I need this to be negative 6x. 3 times negative 2x will give us negative 6x. So I'm going to go ahead and multiply by negative 2. So 2x times 3 will give us 6x, plus 5y times 3 is going to give us 15y is equal to 13 times 3 is 39. And now for the second equation, 3x times negative 2 is negative 6x. Negative 2y times negative 2 is going to give us positive 4y is equal to 10 times negative 2 is negative 20. Next, we're going to combine, and that's where we're going to see this is called the elimination method. 6x minus 6x, they cancel out, it gets eliminated. 15y plus 4y will give us 19y is equal to 39 minus 20 is going to give us 19. Now this is saying 19 times y, so the opposite of multiplication is division. So I'm going to divide by 19, divide by 19, and so y is going to equal to 1. And we can box in this answer. And so if we want to solve for x, we get to pick either the first equation or the second equation. I'm going to go ahead and pick the first equation. So it says 2x plus 5y. Instead of saying 5y, we know y is 1. So we can replace y with 1 is equal to 13. So next we can expand. So we get 2x plus 5 times 1 is 5 is equal to 13. And if we want to get rid of the plus 5y, we got to subtract 5 on both sides. And so we're going to get 2x is equal to 13 minus 5 is 8. And so it's saying 2 times x, so divide by 2, divide by 2, and x is going to equal to 4. So now we have x and y. But it's always a good idea to check. 2 times 4 is 8. 5 times 1 is 5. 8 plus 5 is 13. And now for the second equation. 3 times 4 is 12. Negative 2 times 1 is negative 2. 12 minus 2 is 10. And so it checks out. And that's pretty much it for this video. But in the description box, there's more problems.